The Queen's coronation in 1953 was a lavish event filled with the pomp and pageantry you would expect from the coronation of a British monarch. However, King Charles' coronation is going to be a very different affair. Here's everything we know about the King's upcoming coronation. King Charles' coronation is expected to be on a smaller scale and shorter, with suggestions that it could last just one hour rather than over three. This is expected to make the service more acceptable for TV audiences. Camilla's rarely seen five grandchildren are reportedly set to star alongside Prince William's eldest. The children could have a prominent role in the upcoming event, in one of the two significant breaks with royal precedent. The King and Queen Consort will now not use the Gold State coach to travel from Buckingham Palace to Westminster Abbey in. The royal couple will instead only use the coach on the return journey as they greet crowds on London's streets. The guest list has been drawn up first and foremost by the palace, but they have done it in close consultation with Downing Street and the Foreign Office, with scores of foreign royals, leaders and dignitaries all expected to attend. It's understood Harry and Meghan have been officially invited. More than 8,000 guests attended Queen Elizabeth's coronation in 1953, but it's understood little over 2,000 people will be there in May. Organisers of His Majesty's Big Windsor Castle concert thought it would be a very easy sell, but the people in charge of bookings have reportedly been met by a number of rejections. Brits, Harry Styles, Ed Sheeran, Adele and Robbie Williams are all said to have said no due to their jam-packed schedules.